Hi, um, welcome to a new vlog. We saw in my not today because I feel very in the middle of a bit of a pit at the moment where I don't know what's going on and I need some kind of grasp of accomplishment to feel like as if I belong on this earth, you know what I mean? I'm sure people will know what I mean. I've got my positive top on today, so just keep smiling. I don't know, I, I wear the same thing every day and it really does my head in, so I thought I'll wear something different. Don't know how this is going to go for me, because, um, yeah, I'll probably put the same black hoodie on anyway. I don't know what kind of coat I'm going to wear today. Yeah, I'm going to go and get out of the house. It's 10 to 11, so it's such a late start. This is what I mean. I'm just going to spiral. Um, let's take some snacks with me. Now, I need a new bag, because my Ted Baker one, like my big Ted Baker tote bag that I feel like everyone and the nan had in, like, year, I don't know, 10, 11. It's breaking, like it's gonna break. She's gonna break. I'll put this on. I don't know. Um, yeah, it's gonna break, and I need to get a new one, but I don't know if it's to get another one of them or like a different bag. See, now I've put this jacket on, I just put the same as I normally do anyway. Might have a crumpet before I go because otherwise I'm gonna be starving as soon as I step foot out of the house, but um, yeah, I don't know where I'm gonna go, but I'm just gonna take you on a nice. Nice Monday, sunny, start to the week, productive kind of thing. Um, do you actually need to write in this? See, the thing is, I get a planner and then, like, I don't... I'm trying my hardest to keep on top of it because I refuse by the end of the year for the weeks to be empty. Because I like to write down, like, everything that happens in my week. So it's kind of a bit like a little... I don't know, I can come back and be like, oh, I went there that day. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I just need to update this. And See, the thing is, I can't write in what's going to happen in my week because I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, I'm one of the people who makes plans throughout the week. Um, but I do know that's not happening, so I do need to scribble that out. So yeah, I need to update this at some point. I'll probably do that when I get back. Because like I say... I want to get out the house before I'm just like sat here and it's like one o'clock and I've done absolutely nothing. You know what I mean? Um, I actually really need to order a car mount for my car, obviously, so I can film in the car. But the only ones I found are like they like suction to the windscreen, and I don't, I don't know whether I feel like, I feel like that might be the only option. But that wasn't what I was going for. Productive day. Let's, let's, let's crack on. Thought I'd show you my outfit of the day. I mean, I literally never wear this coat. But I got it out to take a picture of it, to sell it. And, oh my god, what is wrong with my voice? I don't know I'm wearing it. Um, well, are we shocked? Black leggings, white socks, black top. And, at least the coat's different. I mean, I do have a different top on. Not that you can see it, but... Yeah, this is my issue at the moment. I'm trying to sell some stuff, but I cannot for the life of me sell anything anywhere. I don't know wh like, where do I sell stuff. Someone please tell me because I have s I have so many, like a ridiculous amount of clothes that I just I don't even know where to put them or anything, and I just need to sell them. Like I've got them on Depop. I feel like no one really buys them unless it's like two pound and the fees on depop are just ridiculous um so i don't know i really don't know but i'm gonna embrace the green coat today it doesn't look that bad i don't really i don't know it's from zara and it's i'm not trying to sell it to you lot but it's from zara and i've literally worn it like once i don't know it doesn't look that bad today but i just have so many coats that i don't Wear this one. So I put some sunglasses on. I mean, the sun has. I swear I said, the sun has actually gone in. I don't think I've been walking around like this. It doesn't match the normal face from this one. Neither do these. What is going on? I need some lip balm ASAP. Um, I have these. Oh my god. I don't think these are the lives either, to be fair. Do do do. Could work. I think I'll put these in my pocket. I don't know. 
But when I get in the car, I'm, I can't see because the sun's so bright and never have sunglasses. Um, so yeah, I'll put them back there. And I hope the sun comes back out. That's really depressing. Will it? Hey Siri, will the sun come back out today? There's. I'm so determined to read. This is so random, by the way. I'm just waiting for my crumpet. Um, so determined to read some more books. Like, and this is ridiculous because there's so many books I want to read, but I just don't actually like ever commit to putting my phone down to actually then read the book. So that's what it like. So it's really annoying. But it's like just self-sabotage. Everything that is a problem in my life is self-sabotage. Which is why I, I shouldn't moan. Like why, how can I moan when it's just my fault? So I am actually taking my book with me today. I don't know when, at what point I think I'm going to be able to read this book. But just in case anybody wonders. I've been reading this book for like the past three months. And I do really enjoy it. Where am I? I'm like halfway through-ish. Here. It's good, and I have like three other books I need to read, but then there's still more that I'm, like they keep coming up on my Amazon. I want to buy them, but I, I can't keep buying books when I've not even read the ones I've got. Um, so I'm um, using that as I just really like I really enjoy reading, but I just like it's the whole putting your phone down to read. Like it's so much easier to scroll on TikTok. Um, especially like when you get a notification and stuff through, so I need to like learn to what I'm doing to for, like, for like I don't know, even just half an hour of the day, um, so I can read my book. Like it's not that big of a deal. We just get a grip. Um, but yeah, I actually got sent some um, clothes. Wow. Um, and I did a. I did. A, I made like a TikTok about them. But I think I'll show you them later because that'll be so fun for you. If you follow me on, I'm gonna put them on now. If you follow me on TikTok, if you follow me on Instagram. Um, you know, it's a great time over there. And I also need to film a Q and A. So if anybody can ask me some questions, that would be so great. The lighting here is so bad. What am I doing? Yeah, if anyone wants to ask me any questions. Anything that's, that you're dying to know, let me know. Because, yeah, I think I'm going to do like a bit of a mukbang. Mukbang? Mukbang? How do you pronounce that? I don't know. But, oh, I literally, I'm so in love with having a camera to film with. But I just feel like nothing, I feel, I feel like I say this a lot of the time, nothing much interesting is going off at the moment. I mean, it kind of is, but it's also kind of February. Which, in my opinion, is the worst month of the year. Like, January is not that bad. Well, it's my birthday month. It's my mum's birthday month. Like, I feel like... I don't know. I don't hate January, but February... Because it's like, December's Christmas. January's like, oh, run down from Christmas. Like, it's a slippery slope. But February, it just lengthens the whole depression. Of the cold and the new... Year. I can't wait to wear summer stuff so I can actually see my Apple Watch. Yeah, and then I feel like in March and April, it starts getting lighter, you know. The summer starts to roll in, and but February, it's just not it. I'm going to go eat these crumpets and then we'll see wherever I drive to first, to be honest. I don't know. Probably Tesco. Tesco is such a safe space for me. Car is being washed. Imagine the man trying to wash your car and you set your window wipers off. Yeah, after that I will be passing away. Okay, so we're not even going to talk about how awkward that was. Literally, the man was washing the, the windscreen and I tried to put my camera up and then put the, the window wipers off. And he just looked at me like, what are you doing? And I was like, sorry about that. But um, I've come to my favourite place on earth. Um, I'll let you 
Can you guess us now? Ta-da! This is literally my favourite place. I mean, I don't know, like, it's not even, like, the best... I don't know. Whoa, is that going to stay? I hope it doesn't fall. It's not even, like, I don't know, like, not the best place, but it's just such a comfort place for me. Like, I just... I love that shop. Um, so, yeah, I need to get some things from him, bargains. I'm going to have a snoop around to Max, and I might get some salt and pepper chips from the food warehouse. Um, because it's, they're, they're, like, frozen chips... They're so good. They're so good, you need to try them. I always do, like, shopping on a Monday. Like, shopping for things I need for the week. Um, I try to get it done on a Monday. I don't know, it just feels, just feels appropriate. But yeah. Guess where I've just come. Um, right, anyway, just to update on the situation before. Went into Moggins, got wanted, got some sweets and stuff. I'll actually show you it in a bit, but... Um, went into TK Maxx and I'm not going to lie, they had all the summer stuff in. So if you are waiting to get summer stuff, no one's waiting to get summer stuff. But if you want summer clothes, go to TK Maxx right now because they have the best stuff. And it's so affordable. Like, I got so many pairs of shorts from Stradivarius. Like, £6 each. Sorry, can I say no? No. And the woman was like, are you going on holiday? And I was like, no, I'm not going on holiday, I wish. I was like, but these are my favourite shorts and I have to get them. And she was like, yeah, literally. She said, people come in the summer and they're like, have you got any shorts? And I'm like, no, you have to come in January. And I'm like, it's a drill. So I had to get them. Um, but I got some stuff that I can wear to like my festivals and stuff. So I am very excited about that, actually. And yeah, so I am starving. It's quarter past one and I've come to crunch. Why am I filming in the car park? I feel so ridiculously awkward right now. Such a cracking headache, like... I'm gonna step in here trying to open this, like... I don't know why I use this as my water bottle, but... I mean, probably because it's a water bottle. And this truck, by the way, that's next to me is parked so close. It's ridiculous. Um, yeah, I keep drinking that because my head's killing me. And I've been driving around with my shades on, even though the sun's not out, because... It just makes it so dark and so much more manageable when my head is hurting this much. I need some paracetamol. Maybe I've got some actually in here. But yeah, I'm gonna show you what I got. Oh, it looks so good. OMG. Right, you ready? Look at that. Tell me that doesn't look absolutely amazing. And how am I gonna eat this without a fork then? I mean, without a knife. To be honest, I haven't ate halloumi for like a year. Until I went to Nando's the other week with Patrick and we had it as a starter. I know, it was just so good. I just really over ate it when I ate it. I think it was 2020 when I had my Halloumi obsession. Like last year I literally barely touched it. But, hmm, so delicious. You definitely need to dry crunch if you've never been. From if you're a fellow local subscriber, get yourself to crunch. I don't really like roast potatoes, but I don't really like the rice that they do at the moment either. And I hate mash, so this is the best option. They are actually kind of nice. And oh, I get, I haven't even told you what I get. Basically, I get, well, I got halloumi, um, roast potatoes, basic salad, and sweet chilli sauce. I just love sweet chilli sauce. It's the best. Obviously, get the basic salad for the tomatoes. God, what a dinner! Someone's had the car hit in the car park. I have no one to my car. Oh dear, drama llama. I bet it was that massive van that's just been skirting around. She's fuming. This is why you buy little cars. I say that like if someone hasn't hit my car before. About to go to my grandma's house and I'm gonna do some stuff there. Hmm. Probably see you when I get home.
do you a big haul of that stuff I got sent and my TK Maxx gorms when I get back. See you soon. Hi, welcome back. Um, I've just got home. It is 20 to 6. What a day. But, I promise, I'll show you what I got from um, TK Maxx. So, oh my god. How cute are these? I like... I really love these. They're just... You know, they're from Stradivarius. And they're literally £6. Like, for a pair of... Mm, sorry. And these are the, 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 they fit me the best. They're in the vertical ones. And then I just got these ones as well. Just ripped, you know? Literally, love. Six pound again. Also got this t-shirt from, it's Daisy Street or something. I don't even really know what it says. Oh, it says, or, Aurora, Aurora? Is that what it says, Aurora? And then it says Euphoria at the bottom. How fitting, but I literally love a t-shirt like this. Again, six pounds. As for my stuff that I got sent, um, it's a whole lot of black. But um, yeah, I got sent these. Not more than they look long. They're not fit me. Am I on? Is it on? No. Yeah, I'm just recording. Is it? Hello. I like them. I, I literally bought like the same pair of trousers from Sheen. So they, they're too big on the waist. These are most too big for you. Fit me. So you bought these from Sheen? No, they're from... The plates. And me, and me all. These flares, is this how they're supposed to look? Well, obviously, yeah. I love them. Right. Is that the new batch or a proper another the old batch? Batch? This is the first. These are the ones I got sent originally. These are my cargo trousers. These fit. They're a lot. I could have given you them I got free from Centre Fox, they were like that. These came off. The knees unzipped so they were shorts. I'll put it on the screen because I don't know how you pronounce it. Emil, Emil, um, and they all fit except for these trousers, which I'm not really shocked at because I think they're like a size small. I mean, they kind of fit, but they're a bit big on the waist. But they've just got like pockets, and then as Mum stated, they're flares. But yeah, I really love. This is the um, branding. But, um, yeah, I got them, and then I got these cargo trousers, which are quite similar to the ones from Urban. Not the same material, but, um, they kind of fit the same. They're just black cargo trousers, very cargo-y. They are, um, I would say, a little bit on the short side, but they do fit. I just like it when like the trousers fit like bags on top of your shoe. I feel like if you know what I mean, you know what I mean. And then I got some. Oh, I've been looking for that. Um, this jacket. Oh my god, I love this jacket. Very weird. Not weird, but quite cool vibes. It's just black zip up with diamante like rib rib cage thing on. But yeah. Love that. Kind of wish I'd have got a medium though, um, because I do love a big anything really. And then I got um, this blue top, which is inside out. I love this colour. Can I complain? No. Um, bear with. Yeah, look at the print on this. See, I really did love the clothes on the website because they're just different. Look at that. I literally love. So yeah, um, and then 
Got two little like, what do you call them, like tank tops. This is my favourite thing I think. This with the black cargoes. This. I'm sorry, what? How gorgeous is that? Literally love this. I've not worn it yet. Um, so yeah, that's unreal. And then this one, I love this one as well. But that, that one, it's just my favourite. Look at this. Ta-da! Love the red. It's just so like different. Like I really, really love. So thank you so much for sending me that. Um, I do actually have a discount code. I hate to be that girl, but it is. 18 Louise, I think. So if you do order, then you have a discount code to get money off. Do you have a discount code? Like, what an achievement! I think that's quite an achievement. And then I'll show you what I got from Home Bargains. I got some tuck biscuits because these are my favourite things to snack on. And when I went to eat them last night, the only pack I had left was out of date. And then these, which if you've never had these. You are missing out. Um, and then I got some pin liners, which is what I needed. I also got some of the um, the Kinder cards, if you know what I mean. Then they are unreal, very sickly, but unreal. I don't know where I put put them, but yeah, I really need these bin bags. Dinner time! So yeah. Just my silly little Apple Watch. It was funny because when I was getting my car washed, I was like, um, these silly little men in this silly little world washing my silly little car. I don't know why I'm sat like this, but if you get what I mean, you get what I mean. Like, the moments where you just put into perspective the world. Like, I was just sat there and I was like, See silly little men. Not that they're silly, but like it's just like we're just little characters, aren't we? Really? You can tell I've been playing too much Sims. Um, if you don't have Sims, then you need to get it. But hey, oh, oh my God, it's twenty to twelve. <laughs> I had my pizza for dinner, or well, my pizza sub, and then. I went out. These are the things I was on about earlier. I don't have one now. I thought I'd actually end the vlog instead of just um, leaving it till the morning and jumping on and being that person. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed the vlog. I hope it's not too long. And if it is, I hope that you watch to the end. But yeah. I will see you all in my next video, I suppose. I hope you enjoyed.